Hello, welcome back to my Kill Wars. Let's play. Don't have too much time. Pet summoning. Monsters Chapter Eight. All right. On our guild war. Hope absolute artifact chest. Nice. All right. Okay, we only have like six minutes, so let's get some of these up here. 27 still, that's pretty good. Hope that didn't get a win. All right. Oh, there's Kurt. See, so he probably smacked me right back, but we can try it. Been kind of my nemesis. He moved these buttons and it's throwing me off. Try it. We lost Maya. Come on, Arachne. Nope, not a win. 
Try this one. <laughs> it's throwing me off so hard. Playing for almost, like, like I said, over four years, like four and uh, fourth years. Playing this game way too long. Nope. A loss. Try one more time. Nope. We're gonna finish 18th. Oh well. Bye. Nice. A bit closer than I was expected to be, but gosh, gonna throw me off all day. Yeah, no. Against Orion, though, A6 uh, usually pretty good. Guess he can get these. They actually wave dead. Souls of any hero. Get some souls. Great. My God, should be eighty.
magic damage in the campaign. Fine. Kill dungeon. All this energy. Oh, you should be farming a different node. Nice. Rogue missions, so we need to find Helios souls. Helios! Okay, so... We haven't done TOE yet.
All right. Go up here. Oh, these are good. Oh, that's a good one. Nice. And a third one. Boom, there's my three for the week. All right. So let's go read the stories I didn't yesterday because, uh, you know, yesterday's video is long enough. And I figured today would be a good follow up for that. So, story fragments you found in Giro City. Trading Pamplin, welcome to Giro City, capital of dramas. Renowned technicians and engineers visit the drill and pliers to workshop to purchase the latest version of the updated multi purpose mechanical brewers. They know uh, 2,000 more recipes than the brewers uh, Dree Brothers have around the block. Our constructs are not only excellent brewers, but also wonderful companions in Shoulder Crayon. They know a great many jokes and are able to send any gifts out wandering late home on time. The best choices for drama or fest. Cool, we get a unique history fragment to private correspondence. Master Ragni said the last batch of thrusting drills was total rubbish. She said they were prone to breaking, crumbling, and whatnot. She kept shouting that the renowned drama engineers aren't supposed to produce such um, illegible. What am I meant to do when ore deliveries are repeatedly late due to the celebrations and the engineers have decided to feed the reactor from the very deepest elemental springs? Guess I should thank them. They didn't choose the planet's core instead, so I have to make do with what I had in store. I the best I could, mind you. So please send Master Ragni my apologies. My personal is that she's splitting hairs here. Master Sanger, for example, was quite content. Those women, Owen, also... Um, radio broadcast recording. Oh, you could claim our thing. When we get a unique radio broadcast recording. Good morning, Girl City. Good morning, everyone who just woke up. I, Sat Loren, will be with you the entire day. Break your fast, brush your teeth, and hurry up to witness the launch of the ultra modern reactor. We'll finally have electricity and hot water in our houses. The festivities include forging the casting contest, contest, contests, steel making workshops. It's Construct exhibition and massive sale of top quality Illyrium jewelry. Our list of guests features some of the greatest drama masters Ragni, Tellum, Sanger, and Envari. Grab your kids and celebrate with us. Don't forget about the legendary Hammerheads performance scheduled for festivals, closing ceremonies. Yeah, Sanger would actually be an interesting uh, a hero to add to the game. Like I said, you could add her as a hero. That'd be interesting. Hi, the correspondence month. Ah, uh, Thordag, day 28. My esteemed friend, Sanger, master of elemental spirits above water, please attribute my grand eloquent manner of writing to my admiration of the perseverance you've demonstrated in my attempts to cordial mutual friend, Ragni, the master of elemental little fire. Your flirting with her at the tavern, the shrieking drill, was no less obvious than her indifference, for she ignored you altogether. On occasion, she was even angered. Bwahaha. Anyway, don't lose your nerve, pal. Just remember, it's mighty hard for water and fire to be together. And Vari, your comrade. Yeah, so, so Sanger is a lesbian. Who has a crush on uh, Ragni? We get a Ragni avatar. Personal diary. There's so much I need to tell you, my dear diary. Our great and revered king, Master Kornak, presented us with the restored Tain Valley yesterday. I had stood in stagnation for so long, and nobody had ever realized how to awaken this power. Our talented king, however, managed to uncover the secrets of the valley and finally made the elemental spirits work. Now the valley is strong. The power of the elements. In order to crush the enemy's hordes and change our allied titans with energy, our charge our allies' titans' energy, it's absolutely incredible. How does he even find time for all? So, I'm so charming. The most talented drama is only our queen said. So, this is uh, Astrid, I believe, her diary. And, uh,
Oh, wait, so maybe not. Who is, who is this? this uh, whose diary is this? No, so and so. So Astrid's the daughter of the king. Wonder. You know, or maybe she just like thinks her. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. I'm unclear on who this one's from. I'm trying to figure this one out. We get we get Astrid's souls, but. Anyway, hold your recording, hold over now. 8.45 p.m. Calm down, my little daughter. Stop calling me that father. I'm not a child anymore. Said So this is Astrid. She doesn't have a good relationship with her father, so... You behave like one, though. You snuck into the restricted facility to sabotage production. I, the king, had to explain it all to my people. Father, don't you realize that we, the drummers, destroying the planet? While at digging, we'll lose our magnificent mountains, and so many animals will lose their home. There's so much you don't know, Astrid. We're doing it not just for ourselves, but also for the entire world. Drama kind is just to fix mistakes of the long forgotten past. Nothing but our skills can turn it around. Those are just empty words. Uh, we don't understand each other, Dad, at all. Bellman Scroll. Everyone, everyone. Have you seen her, the princess, the only daughter of Master Kornak, the greatest king of the Dramers? We all know her perfectly well, so there's no need to describe her features, the fierce personality, incredible beauty, and fervent love and na for nature. Her tired weapon are marked with royal emblems. The one who finds her shall receive half the royal treasure be elevated to high rank at courts. Gearwell Gossips number 309. The editorial office is receiving multitudes of eyewitness reports describing the odd behavior of people around them. Delirium fever... Uh, blurred speech, strange utterance about the colors, what colors taste like, and other deviations. Make for an incomplete list of symptoms. The looming feeling of something strange happening to us has been present for some time. City's meta confirms influx of patients. Almost all of them are suffering from continual headaches. We'll keep monitoring the situation before any change immediately. So, and you get a uh, Lucas unique. Keen's notes. I've been experiencing headaches for several days now. Today is a disease, and I believe it is a disease. Start progressing. I hear a voice that says no. Demands that I grant it full access to Titan Valley. And wants to control the elemental spirits and all artifacts I invested so much effort into repairing. Ye gods, I am either going mad or someone has invaded my mind. The Guild of City Medics reports that I am not the only one affected. Many residents complain they are haunted by nightmares. Some are leaving the city in panic. There are more and more each day. Others are unable to leave because of their condition. Get reward. Keen's notes. Pain. Unbearable pain has pierced my body. I could hear a familiar voice through the veil of blood, but I couldn't understand who it belonged to. The abductor spoke of the reincarnating Titan and left sealing the dungeon behind them. It touched my head, feeling tight night crystals piercing it. Am I now part of a horrible experiment in my own city? I feel like my head is about to split. After a minute's consideration, I remember I have Rockbreaker, my all-terrain vehicle with self-propelled minds. I always carry the remote control with me. All I had to do was press the button and wait. In mere five minutes, dungeon wall exploded in thousands of small shards. I climbed the mechanical platform. The pain nearly caused me to faint the process. I believe I now know what's happening. Get another unique. Keen's notes. It's so difficult now. He came and someone helped him. The one whose voice I recognized in the dungeon. He's the true enemy. He revived what should have perished in the elemental ether for good. I cannot. I must not give in and let him take this world. I'm a madman, and all madmen deserve death, but I, I won't surrender the Titan Valley. Watch out, Seymour. Cursed Titan, someone might have freed you, but I shall stop you. Witness, and let the realization seep in. I'm more powerful than you. The Titan Valley is slipping through my fingers, and you'll never find it soon. The overheater's reacted, reactor explosion will turn me to ashes, but I'll take you with take you to Astrid, my daughter. Please realize I'm doing this all to save my people. Defeat the evil king at last. Ugh. Get another unique... Butler's Constructs Witness Report. I don't even know how to put into words, but I thought it was a genuine apocalypse. A powerful jolt knocked me down. I heard a terribly rumbling noise, and everything started shaking so much. The dishes I had just set became came rattling off the table. I suddenly see an incredible bright light through the window. When I ran outside in panic, I saw the upper city with all the hanging lights, construction beams and columns ascend from the mound, slowly accelerating as it kept rising. The rivers flooded down from the surface and into the newly formed abyss. Uh, rock shards and torn communication lines fell. Years of work and construction engineering genius were destroyed right for the city's residents. So, Butler, witness reports. Unread letter. I know I was too harsh with you, Father, so this has got to be from Astrid. I admit I couldn't understand your opinion, couldn't accept your views, even though you love your people more than any drama. Carrying the burden of responsibility for all of us, and that will eventually be your downfall. You put your blood, sweat, and tears in your subjects, but nobody 
knows if all of them are willing to remain by your side to the end. First and foremost, though, I fear that uh, your insatiable thirst for science and your striving to uncover the secrets of the universe at any cost could spell the end for Gearwell City. Please forgive your careless daughter. Safety guide. The personnel is to be briefed at least twice per year. Be a graduated technician, obey the master's orders directly. Special day, special protection for the face and hands required before launch the reactor. Ensure that the technical compartment diagram number one is sealed to cool and hermetically sealed. At least uh, 100 units of substance required for the reactor to operate sustainably. The cooled supplies be stored in special tanks. Another Lucas unique. Consignment note, recipient, Bond Brothers Cartel Object Circle, summoning Tainite 95.5 tons plus 8 tons for the previous incomplete shipment. Arunian Steel, 752 tons. River Star Crystal, 20.5 tons. Olean Bars, 81.9 tons. Drama L, 100 liters. Fender's note, Drama L, huh? Make sure you don't fall behind on the deadlines. The construction of 70, Circle 70 is almost over. Don't match everything in time. The city authorities will have to postpone the festivities and will have to search for a new job. Page from the book tells the three peoples owed seven. Darkness has no beginning, no end, just as inseparable counterpart light. The words carved on the drama stills reads the fall. Each soul is here, but or unattractive and empty, but there's always a treasure inside waiting to be found. Dozens of years ago, mighty and wise times of forces of nature incarnate roamed around the dominion. The cities of the humans, heirs of the forerunners, grew at an unprecedented pace beneath layers of rock in the mountains lived as industrious dramas, the very embodiment of unstable curiosity and engineering prowess. The peoples of the Dominion dwelled in peace and prosperity. Another unique. Page from the book tells the three peoples owed eight. The vile deceit of Seymour the Titan to turn to darkness changed life for the Dominion in an abrupt turn of fate. The Titans, the humans, the former allies, descended a bloody war. The Titans possessing a boundless power of elements led by Seymour the Betrayer, destroyer the human satellites in the blink of an eye, flooding them, turning them into ashes, or burying them beneath the earth, and the darkness followed them, wiping out everything they had left behind. The war threatened to spell the doom of the human race. Mori Astrid Souls. Page from the book tells the three peoples owed nine. The only ones capable of stopping that war were the Valkyrie, as the maidens of the sky showed no mercy to those at war. They drove darkness away from the land, seizing the power of the artifacts from humans, eliminating the Titans' as punishment. Dissolving them in the elemental ether, history knows many a sad moment, but the Dominion shall not forget the outcome of that war. Will the Titan race be reborn again? Will humans take their power back? More importantly, one has to wonder whether darkness will return to the Dominion. What happens to the soul after the, of the Dark Titan? We, the drama, shall keep the knowledge race stand up against evil. So we get a Valkyrie unique. Valley of the Elements Guardian Report. I'm amazed. Now that the valley is home to the elemental spirits, it looks alive. All the loose ends have been taken care of. The totems restored by our engineers allowed us to lose not a drop of the valuable spring energy. Our quality setup led us to direct their work currents where we had to. Alter of Elements is now working at full capacity. I believe we're ready to show our invention to the great times for the artifacts produced by Drama Kind have achieved absolute perfection. Get reward. Chronicle Deeds of the Forerunners, Path of the Perfect Ode, Seven Among the Forerunners, Those Who Were Perfect in Their Knowledge and Manifestation, Where He Who Loved the Children, He Had Constructed More Than Anything in the World. Tells of Doug, the constructor, exists across many realms. Uh, he was given the name for his gift of creating living creatures and races in absolute harmony with their home realms. This place is the uh, symbolizes the furnace of the body and soul, the one in which Doug formed a great many races, including the drama, his children. As we worship the how deeds we create, produce, and anime, just like Doug the Constructor himself. Get another unique. Annal Examination of Elemental Masters Results Verbatim Dear esteemed colleagues, the results of another examination are in. They came as a surprise, even for veteran committee members, and even when reached the kingdom himself, the elements have made their choice, neglecting the most promising scholar, Telem Tall, to say that Telem was frustrated being understatement. Nevertheless, we believe the young master will find his fortune calling next time. Another unique. Turn tell him to the dark side. Unsent letter of Master Helm, destination of the Royal Palace. My dear beloved princess, since I first saw you, my soul uh, knows no rest. My heart feels like a bird in a cage. Surely you must remember me, for I am among the students of your revered master, father, Master Court. I can realize where I stand at court. I'm where I won't be able to approach you, princess. Still, I'm going to do everything in chief glory, the greatest heights of academia. The title is due to me. You'll hear me again. I dare hope that you'll notice me and feel the same for me as I do you. So there's uh, another Lucas unique. So tell him I had a crush on Astrid. 
Master Tellum Tall's lab journal, page 34. The results of my experiments with Titanite have an astonishing conclusion. Turns out the souls of the Titans disembodied uh, during the First War of Darkness haven't been destroyed. They were sent to a certain past space instead, one we call Elemental Ether. One can't describe it in detail. It resembles a field of information alloy of souls, what they have. It's not impossible that we could create a device capable of reacting to the souls of the Titans from the Elemental Ether. Um, that's Tellum. A uh, unique. Another Tellum one. Uh, Master Tellum Tall's Lab Journal, page 52. 4.13 p.m. I believe I found something extraordinary. The soul of a time, which is unlike anything I've previously encountered in the elemental ether. This is by far my best discovery. 8.01 p.m. Having to extract a sticky and extract the soul I found, even after several times. What kind of power does it possess? Tell him, Master Tellum Tall's Lab Journal, page 71. 9.56 a.m. I need to extract that time. I absolutely must have it. According to my calculations, though, I'll need an enormous amount of unbound energy. Achieve my goal. I'm ready for it at the eve of death. Initiate process yet again. 12.27 p.m. I heard so much, so much. Science is worth it, though. I'm a scientist. I could tackle anything for new discoveries. Master, tell him Tall's journal page uh, illegible. 4.33 a.m. Cursed. Curse these wretched attempts. I gave away my heart. And what did I get return? One. Just one soul. Curse it all. 6 a.m. Ooh, now that I've calmed down, I have to try and think rationally in order to find a solution. What's this voice I hear in my head, though? 12.56 uh, p.m. It's settled. I'll install the stone. I've obtained in the reactor... Circle in order to subject the city residents to my will and use them all as living sources, living summoning stones. I'll obtain all the Titan's black soul stones. I'll obtain the Titan itself. I'll speak about it so calmly. I'm a bit surprised myself. 1.30 p.m. That voice in my head again. Yes, the ritual. I have to prepare for the most important event in my life. So, like I said, so tell him. Like, he gets obsessed with uh, summoning the Seymour, the Titan Seymour, that uh, he subjects all the city's residents into, like, his dark summoning. And that's why you see all the... All the dramas and those black crystals and stuff towards the end of the campaign is because he's using them all as essentially summoning souls, souls for uh, Seymour. Master Tellen Paul's lab journal page. Illegible. Everything is going according to plan. The reactor did what it is supposed to. Spreading the energy of the stone, turning most dramas into fanatics. They submit to it, obsessed with the thought of death for the incarnation of the greatest Titan ever. It may be a crude and clumsy solution, but they pierce the unpolished Titanite crystals through the skulls of those who didn't answer the call of the stone right away. They'll make for great black soul stones after the ritual. Silent statue, like black, like pure onyx. This is the final form of each and every one who takes part in my grand experiment. More souls from living bodies means more energy for me to release the souls of that unique Titan. I'll control it, gaining its power for myself. This will be the great discovery of the famous scientist Tellum Tall. Valkyrie's speech, the circle of history has closed. Seymour, the one who turned the magnificent land's dominion to realm of discord and death, has been captured thanks to the efforts of the Titans, humans, and dramas. The villain has been locked in the gel of light for good. Seymour's whisper has gone silent. The delusion he uh, has appeared with it. A long time shall yet pass before the Guardians eradicate what remains of the cultists and defective constructs, but there will become a day when the city's residents will be free. To return to the lives they once lived, lights and laughter filling their homes, fame manages its affairs, leaving us out. What else does it have in store for great peoples of the Dominion? We, the Valkyries, shall watch over them, protect them as they live and prosper. So this is a scene more unique. And that is the end of the story. There's 28 fragments. Boom. Like I said, so that's the story of Gearwill City. Um, that's, uh, we got, I think that's it on this episode. Don't have anything else to do. So I thank you all for watching. Come join for the next one. We'll see you again soon.